Rotterdam, UK also, Dutch, Arter Diem listen, is the second largest city, behind Amsterdam and a municipality of the Netherlands. It is located in the province of South Holland, at the mouth of the New Moss Channel leading into the rhine meuse scheldt delta at the North Sea. Its history goes back to 1270, when a dam was constructed in the rot, after which people settled around it for safety. In 1340, Rotterdam was granted city rights by the Count of Holland, a major logistic and economic centre. Rotterdam is Europe's largest port. It has a population of 633,471. 2017. Rotterdam is known for its Erasmus University, its riverside setting, lively cultural life, and maritime heritage. The near-complete destruction of the city centre in the World War II Rotterdam Blitz has resulted in a varied architectural landscape, including skyscrapers an uncommon sight in other Dutch cities designed by renowned architects such as Rem Koolhaas, Piet Blom and Ben van Berkel. The Rhine, Meuse and Scheldt give waterway access into the heart of Western Europe, including the highly industrialised Ruhr. The extensive distribution system including rail, roads, and waterways have earned Rotterdam the nicknames Gateway to Europe and Gateway to the World. History The settlement at the lower end of the Fen Stream Rot or Rotta, as it was then known, from Rot, Muddy, and A water, thus, muddy water, dates from at least 900 CE. Around 1150, large floods in the area ended development, leading to the construction of protective dikes and dams, including Shilin's Hoog Zedek, Shilin's High Sea Dike, along the northern banks of the present-day New Moss. A dam on the rot was built in the 1260s and was located at the present-day Hoogstraat, High Street. On 7 July 1340, Count Willem IV of Holland granted city rights to Rotterdam, whose population then was only a few thousand. Around the year 1350, a shipping canal, the Rotterdam Zeshi was completed, which provided Rotterdam access to the larger towns in the north, allowing it to become a local trans-shipment centre between the Netherlands, England and Germany, and to urbanise. The port of Rotterdam grew slowly but steadily into a port of importance, becoming the seat of one of the six chambers of the Verenigde Oostindische Company (VOC), the Dutch East India Company. The greatest spurt of growth, both in port activity and population, followed the completion of the new water weg in 1872. The city and harbour started to expand on the south bank of the river. The Wit Huis or White House skyscraper, inspired by American office buildings and built in 1898 in the French Chateau style, is evidence of Rotterdam's rapid growth and success. When completed, it was the tallest office building in Europe, with a height of 45 meters (147.64 feet). During World War I the city was the world's largest spy centre because of Dutch neutrality and its strategic location in between Great Britain, Germany and German-occupied Belgium. Many spies who were arrested and executed in Britain were led by German secret agents operating from Rotterdam. MI6 had its main European office on De Boompjes. From there the British coordinated espionage in Germany and occupied Belgium. During World War I, an average of 25,000 Belgian refugees lived in the city, as well as hundreds of German deserters and escaped Allied prisoners of war. During World War II, the German army invaded the Netherlands on 10 May 1940. Adolf Hitler had hoped to conquer the country in just one day, but his forces met unexpectedly fierce resistance. The Dutch army was forced to capitulate on 15 May 1940, following the bombing of Rotterdam on 14 May and the threat of bombing of other Dutch cities. The heart of Rotterdam was almost completely destroyed by the Luftwaffe. Some 80,000 civilians were made homeless and 900 were killed, a relatively low number due to the fact that many had fled the city because of the warfare and bombing going on in Rotterdam since the start of the invasion three days earlier. The city hall survived the bombing. Ossip Zadkine later attempted to capture the event with his statue de Verwoest Stad, the destroyed city. 
The statue stands near the Louvhaven, not far from the Erasmusbrug in the centre of the city, on the north shore of the river New Moss. Rotterdam was gradually rebuilt from the 1950s through to the 1970s. It remained quite windy and open until the city councils from the 1980s on began developing an active architectural policy. Daring and new styles of apartments, office buildings and recreation facilities resulted in a more livable city centre with a new skyline. In the 1990s, the KOP Van Zuid was built on the south bank of the river as a new business centre. Rotterdam was voted 2015 European City of the Year by the Academy of Urbanism. A Guardian profile of Rem Koolhaas begins, if you put the last 50 years of architecture in a blender, and spat it out in building-sized chunks across the skyline, you would probably end up with something that looked a bit like Rotterdam. Topic. Geography Rotterdam is divided into a northern and a southern part by the river New Moss, connected by, from west to east, the Benelux Tunnel, the Moss Tunnel, the Erasmusbrug Erasmus Bridge, a subway tunnel, the Willemsport Tunnel, Willems Railway Tunnel, the Willemsbrug Willems Bridge, the Koningenebrug Queens Bridge, and the Van Brienenoordbrug Van Brienenoord Bridge. The former railway lift bridge De Hef the lift, is preserved as a monument in lifted position between the Nordereiland North Island, and the south of Rotterdam. The city centre is located on the northern bank of the New Moss, although recent urban development has extended the centre to parts of southern Rotterdam known as De Kop van Zuid, the head of south, i.e. the northern part of southern Rotterdam. From its inland core, Rotterdam reaches the North Sea by a swath of predominantly harbour area. Built mostly behind dikes, large parts of the Rotterdam are below sea level. For instance, the Prins Alexander Polder in the northeast of Rotterdam extends 6 metres 20 feet below sea level, or rather below Normal Amsterdam's Peel NAP, or Amsterdam Ordnance Datum. The lowest point in the Netherlands, 6.76 meters, 22.2 feet below Nap, is situated just to the east of Rotterdam in the municipality of Newerkerk on den IJssel. The Rot River no longer joins the New Moss directly. Since the early 1980s, when the construction of Rotterdam's second subway line interfered with the Rot's course, its waters have been pumped through a pipe into the New Moss via the Boringat. Between the summers of 2003 and 2008, an artificial beach was created at the Boomgeskade along the New Moss, between the Erasmus Bridge and the Willems Bridge. Swimming was not possible, digging pits was limited to the height of the layer of sand, about 50 cm 20 in. Alternatively people go the beach of Hook van Holland which is a Rotterdam district or one of the beaches in Zeeland, Rennes or the Zuid Hollandse Eilanden, Odorp, Oostvorn. Rotterdam forms the centre of the Rhineman conurbation, bordering the conurbation surrounding The Hague to the northwest. The two conurbations are close enough to be a single conurbation. They share the Rotterdam The Hague airport and a light rail system called Randstadrail. Consideration is being given to creating an official metropolitan region Rotterdam The Hague Metropolregio Rotterdam Den Haag, which would have a combined population approaching 2.5 million. On its turn, the Rhineman conurbation is part of the southern wing, the Zoidvlugel, of the Randstad, which is one of the most important economic and densely populated areas in the northwest of Europe. Having a population of 7.1 million, the Randstad is the sixth largest urban area in Europe after Moscow, London, Paris, Istanbul, and the Rhine Ruhr area. The Zoidvlugel, situated in the province of South Holland, has a population of around 3 million. Topic. Climate Rotterdam experiences a temperate oceanic climate, Köppen climate classification CFB, similar to all of the coastal areas in Netherlands. Located near to the coast, its climate is slightly milder than locations further inland. Winters are cool with frequent cold days, while the summers are mild to warm, with occasional hot temperatures. 
Temperatures above 30 degrees Celsius are not rare during summer, as well as temperatures under minus 5 degrees Celsius during winter. The following climate box is from the airport, which is slightly cooler than the city, being surrounded by water canals which make the climate milder and with a higher relative humidity. The city experiences the urban heat island effect, especially inside the city center. Topic. Demographics Overall the demographics differ per city area. According to a recent area analysis, the city center has a singles population of 70%, between the ages of 20 and 40, considerably more than other city areas. Also the city center has a much larger population of people with higher education and higher income. Nonetheless, 80% of the homes are rented, not owned. The city center also has a higher percentage 51% versus 45% of foreign-born citizens. The majority 70 of shops are also run by foreign-born citizens. Topic. Composition On 1 January 2015, source, Statistics Netherlands, the municipality covered an area of 319 square kilometers, 206.44 square kilometers of which is land, with a population of 623,956. It is part of the Rotterdam The Hague metropolitan area with a total population of approximately 2.3 million. In 1965, the municipal population of Rotterdam reached its peak of 731,000, but by 1984 it had decreased to 555,000 as a result of suburbanization. Rotterdam consists of 14 submunicipalities: Centrum, Charleroi including Heiplat, Delfshaven, Feigenoord, Hilligersberg Schiebroek, Hoek van Holland, Hoogvliet, Ijsselmond, Kralingen Kruisweg, Noord, Overstje, Pernies, and Prins Alexander, the most populous sub municipality with around 85,000 inhabitants. One other area, Rosenberg, does have an official sub-municipality status since 18 March 2010. The current size of the municipality of Rotterdam is the result of the amalgamation of the following former municipalities, some of which now are a sub-municipality. Delfshaven, added on 30 January 1886. Charleroi added on the 28th of February 1895. Kralingen added on the 28th of February 1895. Hoogvliet added on the 1st of May 1934. Pernies added on the 1st of May 1934. Hilligersberg added on the 1st of August 1941. Iselman added on the 1st of August 1941. Overstje added on the 1st of August 1941. Schiebroek added on the 1st of August 1941. Rosenberg added on the 18th of March 2010. Topic: <laughs> Ethnic makeup. In the Netherlands, Rotterdam has the highest percentage of foreigners from non-industrialized nations. They form a large part of Rotterdam's multi-ethnic and multicultural diversity. 50.3% of the population are of non-Dutch origins or have at least one parent born outside the country. There are 80,000 Muslims, constituting 13% of the population. The mayor of Rotterdam, Ahmed Aboutalib, is of Moroccan descent and is a practicing Muslim. The city is home to the largest Dutch Antillean community. The city also has its own Chinatown at the West Cruiskade, close to Rotterdam Central. Topic. Religion Christianity is the largest religion in Rotterdam, with 31.1% of the population identifying. The second and third largest religions are Islam 13.3% and Hinduism 3.3%, while about half of the population has no religious affiliation. Since 1795 Rotterdam has hosted the chief congregation of the liberal Protestant Brotherhood of Remonstrants. 
From 1955 it has been the see of the Bishop of Rotterdam when the Rotterdam Diocese was split from the Harlem Diocese. Since 2010 the city is home to the largest mosque in the Netherlands, the Esalam Mosque, capacity 1,500. Topic economy Rotterdam has always been one of the main centers of the shipping industry in the Netherlands. From the Rotterdam Chamber of the VOC, the world's first multinational, established in 1602, to the merchant shipping leader Royal Neteloid established in 1970, with its corporate headquarters located in the landmark building the Willemswerf in 1988. In 1997, Neteloid merged with the British shipping industry leader P&O forming the third largest merchant shipping company in the world. The Anglo-Dutch P&O Neteloid was bought by the Danish giant corporation AP Mahler Maersk in 2005 and its Dutch operations are still headquartered in the Willemswerf. Nowadays, well-known companies with headquarters in Rotterdam are consumers goods company Unilever, asset management firm Robeco, energy company Inico, dredging company Van Ord, oil company Shell Downstream, terminal operator Vopac, commodity trading company Vital and architecture firm Office for Metropolitan Architecture. It is also home to the regional headquarters of chemical company Lyondelbasel, commodities trading company Glencore, pharmaceutical company Pfizer, logistics companies Stolt Nielsen, electrical equipment company AB Group and consumer goods company Procter & Gamble. Furthermore, Rotterdam has the Dutch headquarters of Allianz, Maersk, Petrobras, Samskip, Louis Dreyfus Group, Aon and MP Objects. The city of Rotterdam makes use of the services of semi-government companies Rotterdam and students of Rotterdam Business School RBS to take care of sanitation, waste management and assorted services and the Port of Rotterdam Authority to maintain the Port of Rotterdam. Both these companies were once municipal bodies, now they are autonomous entities, owned by the city. Being the largest port and one of the largest cities of the country, Rotterdam attracts many people seeking jobs, especially in the cheap labor segment. The city's unemployment rate is 12%, almost twice the national average. Topic. Ports Rotterdam is the largest port in Europe, with the rivers Meuse and Rhine providing excellent access to the hinterland upstream reaching to Basel, Switzerland and into France. In 2004 Shanghai took over as the world's busiest port. In 2006, Rotterdam was the world's seventh largest container port in terms of 20-foot equivalent units TEU handled. The port's main activities are petrochemical industries and general cargo handling and transshipment. The harbour functions as an important transit point for bulk materials between the European continent and overseas. From Rotterdam goods are transported by ship, river barge, train or road. In 2007, the Batuwiroute, a new fast freight railway from Rotterdam to Germany, was completed. Topic. Shopping. Well-known streets in Rotterdam are the Leinbahn, the first set of pedestrian streets of the country, opened in 1953, the Hoogstraat, the Koolsingel with the City Hall, and the Wiener, which runs from the central station to the Hofplein Square. A modern shopping venue is the Borstraverse, Stock Exchange Traverse, better known by its informal name, Koopgut, buying, shopping gutter, after its subterranean position, which crosses the Koolsingel below street level. The Cruiskade is a more upscale shopping street, with retailers like Michael Kors, Seven for All Mankind, Calvin Klein, Hugo Boss, Tommy Hilfiger and the Dutch well-known men's clothier Ogre. Another upscale shopping venue is a flagship store of department store De Bijenkorf. Located a little more to the east is the Markthal, with lots of small retailers inside. This hall is also one of Rotterdam's famous architectural landmarks. The main shopping venue in the south of Rotterdam is Zoidplein, which lies close to Rotterdam Ahoy, an accommodation centre for shows, exhibitions, sporting events, concerts and congresses. Another prominent shopping centre, called Alexandrium, lies in the east of Rotterdam. It includes a large kitchen and furniture centre.
Topic Education Rotterdam has one major university, the Erasmus University Rotterdam UR, named after one of the city's famous former inhabitants, Desiderius Erasmus. The Woudestein campus houses, among others, Rotterdam School of Management, Erasmus University. In Financial Times 2005 rankings it placed 29th globally and 7th in Europe. In the 2009 rankings of Masters of Management, the school reached first place with the CEMS Master in Management and a tenth place with its RSM Master in Management. The university is also home to Europe's largest student association, Star Study Association Rotterdam School of Management, Erasmus University and the world's largest student association, AIESEC, has its international office in the city. The Willem de Kooning Academy Rotterdam's main art school, which is part of the Hogeschool Rotterdam. It is regarded as one of the most prestigious art schools in the Netherlands and the number one in advertising and copywriting. Part of the Willem de Kooning Academy is the Piet Zwart Institute for Postgraduate Studies and Research in Fine Art, Media Design and Retail Design. The Piet Zwart Institute boasts a selective roster of emerging international artists. The Hoboken campus of Ur houses the Dijkzeit General Hospital, the Sophia Hospital for Children, and the Medical Department of the University. They are known collectively as the Erasmus Medical Center. This center is ranked third in Europe by CSIC as a hospital, and is also ranked within top 50 universities of the world in the field of medicine, clinical, preclinical, and health. 2017, three Hogeschulen Universities of Applied Sciences exist in Rotterdam. These schools award their students a professional bachelor's degree and postgraduate or master's degree. The three Hogeschulen are Hogeschool Rotterdam, Hogeschool Inholland and Hogeschool voor Muziek en Dans Uni for Music and Dance which is also known as Codarts. As there are many international and American schools scattered across Europe such as ASH American International School of the Hague Rotterdam also has its own international, American school by the name AISR American International School of Rotterdam. At AISR children receive a multicultural education in a culturally diverse community and it offers the International Baccalaureate IB Diploma Program. Unique to the city is the Shipping and Transport College which offers Masters, Bachelors and Vocational Diplomas on all levels. Topic. Culture Alongside Porto, Rotterdam was European capital of culture in 2001. The city has its own orchestra, the Rotterdam Philharmonic, with its well-regarded young music director Yannick Nezet Sagan, a large congress and concert building called De Dolan, several theatres including the New Luxor and movie theatres, and the Ahoy Rotterdam complex in the south of the city, which is used for pop concerts, exhibitions, tennis tournaments, and other activities. A major zoo called Diergard Blijdorp is situated at the northwest side of Rotterdam, complete with a walk-through sea aquarium called the Oceanium. Rotterdam features some urban architecture projects, nightlife, and many summer festivals celebrating the city's multicultural population and identity, such as the Caribbean-inspired Summer Carnival, the Dance Parade, Rotterdam 666, the Metropolis Pop Festival, and the World Port Days. In the years 2005 to 2011 the city struggled with venues for pop music. Many of the venues suffered severe financial problems. This resulted in the disappearance of the major music venues Nighttown and Watt and smaller stages such as Waterfront, Exit, and Heidegger. Currently the city has a few venues for pop music like Rotown, Porgebau and Annabelle. The venue Worm focuses on experimental music and related cutting-edge subcultural music. There are also the International Film Festival in January, the Poetry International Festival in June, the North Sea Jazz Festival in July, the Valerie Gergiev Festival in September, September in Rotterdam and the World of the Witte with in June 1970, the Holland Pop Festival, which featured Jefferson Airplane, The Birds, Canned Heat, It's a Beautiful Day, and Santana, was held and filmed at the Stamping Grounds in Rotterdam. 
There is a healthy competition with Amsterdam, which is often viewed as the cultural capital of the Netherlands. There is a saying, Amsterdam to party, Den Haag the Hague, to live, Rotterdam to work. Another one, more popular by Rotterdammers, is, Money is earned in Rotterdam, distributed in The Hague and spent in Amsterdam. Another saying that reflects both the rivalry between Rotterdam and Amsterdam is, Amsterdam has it, Rotterdam doesn't need it. In terms of alternative culture, Rotterdam had from the 1960s until the 2000s a thriving squatters movement which as well as housing thousands of people, occupied venues, social centers and so on. From this movement came clubs like Boogheys, EKSIT, Nighttown, V Lurk and Waterfront. The Porgebau was squatted in the 1980s and quickly legalized. Rotterdam is also the home of Gabber, a type of hardcore electronic music popular in the mid-1990s, with hard beats and samples. Groups like Neophyte and Rotterdam Terror Core RTC, started in Rotterdam, playing at clubs like Parkzicht. The main cultural organizations in Amsterdam, such as the Concertgebouw and Holland Festival, have joint forces with similar organizations in Rotterdam, via Ardam. In 2007 these organizations published with plans for cooperation. One of the goals is to strengthen the international position of culture and art in the Netherlands in the international context. Topic. Museums Rotterdam has many museums. Well-known museums are the Museum Boijmans van Boeningen, the Netherlands Architecture Institute, the Wereldmuseum, the Kunsthal, Witte with Center for Contemporary Art and the Maritime Museum Rotterdam. The historical Museum Rotterdam has changed into Museum Rotterdam which aims to exhibit Rotterdam as a contemporary transnational city, and not a past city. Other museums include the Tax Museum and the Natural History Museum. At the historical shipyard and museum Sheepsworth, de Delft, the reconstruction of ship of the line Delft can be visited. Topic architecture In 1898, the 45-metre high-rise office building the White House in Dutch Huis was completed, at that time the tallest office building in Europe. In the first decades of the 20th century, some influential architecture in the modern style was built in Rotterdam. Notable are the Van Nel Fabriek 1929, a monument of modern factory design by Brinkman in Van der Vlugt, the Jugendstil Clubhouse of the Royal Moss Yacht Club designed by Hoekaas Jr. in Brinkman 1909, and Feyenoord's Football Stadium de Kuip 1936, also by Brinkman in Van der Vlugt. The architect J. J. P. Oud was a famous Rotterdammer in those days. The Van Nel factory obtained the status of UNESCO World Heritage Site in 2014. During the early stages of World War II the center of Rotterdam was bombed by the German Luftwaffe, destroying many of the older buildings in the center of the city. After initial crisis reconstruction the center of Rotterdam has become the site of ambitious new architecture. Rotterdam is also famous for its Linebahn 1952 by architects Broek and Bakima, Pepperclip by architect Karel Weber, Kubuswaningen or Cube Houses designed by architect Piet Blom 1984. The newest landmark in Rotterdam is the Markthal, designed by architect firm MVRDV. In addition to that there are many international well-known architects based in Rotterdam like OMA, Rem Koolhaas, Noodlings and Riedek and Eric van Egerot to name a few. Two architectural landmarks are located in the Lloydwardier, the STC College Building and the Central 4B. Rotterdam also houses several of the tallest structures in the Netherlands. The Erasmusbrug 1996 is a 790 meter 2600 feet cable stayed bridge linking the north and south of Rotterdam. It is held up by a 138 meters 453 feet tall pylon with a characteristic bend earning the bridge its nickname De Zwan, the Swan. Rotterdam has the tallest residential building in the Netherlands, the New Orleans Tower, 158.35 meters, 519.5 feet. 
Rotterdam is also home to the tallest office building, Mostoren, 164.75 meters or 540.5 feet, which houses Deloitte. This office tower surpassed the Delphi Seaport, 160 meters or 520 feet, which houses Nationale Nederlanden Insurance Company, part of Ing Group as tallest office tower in 2009. The city also houses the 186 meters (610 feet) tall Euromast, which is a major tourist attraction. It was built in 1960, initially reaching a height of 101 meters (331 feet). In 1970, the Euromast was extended by 85 meters (279 feet) to its current height. Rotterdam has a reputation in being a platform for architectural development and education through the Berlage Institute, a postgraduate laboratory of architecture, and the NIE (Netherlands Architecture Institute), which is open to the public and has a variety of good exhibitions on architecture and urban planning issues. Over 30 new high-rise projects are being developed at the moment. A Guardian journalist wrote in 2013 that all this is the consequence of the city suffering a bombardment of two things, bombs and architects, high-rise buildings that are currently being built, Zalmhaventoren, with a height of 215 meters 705 feet, the highest building in the Netherlands when completed. The tower is expected to be completed in 2021. Topic. Sports Rotterdam calls itself Sportstad City of Sports. The city annually organizes several world-renowned sporting events. Some examples are the Rotterdam Marathon, the World Port Tournament, and the Rotterdam World Tennis Tournament. Rotterdam also organizes one race of the Red Bull Air Race World Championship and the car racing event Monaco en de Maas Monaco at the Meuse. The city is also the home of many sports clubs and some historic and iconic athletes. Topic. Football Rotterdam is the home of three professional football clubs, being first-tier clubs Feyenoord and Excelsior and second-tier club Sparta. Feyenoord, founded in 1908 and the dominant of the three professional clubs, has won 15 national titles since the introduction of professional football in the Netherlands. It won the European Cup, current Champions League, as the first Dutch club in 1970, and won the World Cup for club teams in the same year. In 1974, they were the first Dutch club to win the UEFA Cup and in 2002, Feyenoord won the UEFA Cup again. In 2008, the year of their 100-year anniversary, Feyenoord won the KNVB Cup. Seating 51,480, its 1937 stadium, called Stadion Feyenoord but popularly known as De Kuip, the Tub, is the second largest in the country, after the Amsterdam Arena. De Kuip, located in the southeast of the city, has hosted many international football games, including the final of Euro 2000 and has been awarded a FIFA 5-star ranking. There are concrete plans to build a new stadium with a capacity of at least 63,000 seats. Sparta, founded in 1888 and situated in the northwest of Rotterdam, won the national title six times. Excelsior, founded 1902, in the northeast, has never won any. Rotterdam also has three fourth-tier clubs, SC Feyenoord, Feyenoord Amateurs, PVV Doto and TOGR. Rotterdam is and has been the home to many great football players and coaches, among whom Topic. Marathon Rotterdam has its own annual international marathon, which offers one of the fastest courses in the world. From 1985 until 1998, the world record was set in Rotterdam, first by Carlos Lopez and later in 1988 by Belena Densamo. In 1998, the world record for women was set by Tegla Lorup, in a time of 2 minutes 20 seconds and 47 milliseconds. Lorup won the Rotterdam Marathon three consecutive times, from 1997 to 1999. 
The current track record for men is held by Duncan Kibbett, who ran a time of 2 minutes 4 seconds and 27 milliseconds in 2009. The female record was set in 2012, when Tiki Jalana finished the race in 2 minutes 18 seconds and 58 milliseconds. Jalana went on to become the 2012 Olympic champion in London, a few months later. The marathon starts and ends on the Coolsingle in the heart of Rotterdam. It attracts a total of 900.000 visitors. Topic. Tennis Since 1972, Rotterdam hosts the indoor hard court ABN AMRO World Tennis Tournament, part of the ATP Tour. The event was first organized in 1972, when it was won by Arthur Ashe. Ashe went on to win the tournament two more times, making him the singles title record holder. Former Wimbledon winner Richard Krejcik became the tournament director after his retirement in 2000. The latest edition of the tournament attracted a total of 116.354 visitors. Topic. Tour de France 2010 In November 2008 Rotterdam was chosen as the host of the Grand Depart of the 2010 Tour de France. Rotterdam won the selection over the Dutch city of Utrecht. Germany's Dusseldorf had previously also expressed interest in hosting. The Amori Sport Organization ASO, organizer of the Tour de France, said in a statement on its website that it chose Rotterdam because, in addition to it being another big city, like London, to showcase the use of bikes for urban transportation, it provided a location well positioned considering the rest of the route envisioned for the 2010 event. The start in Rotterdam was the fifth in the Netherlands. The prologue was a 7 km miles individual time trial crossing the center of the city. The first regular stage left the Erasmusbrug and went south, towards Brussels. Topic. Rowing Members of the student rowing club SCADI were part of the Holland Oct, winning a gold medal at the Olympics in 1996. Since the opening in April 2013, Rotterdam hosts the rowing venue Willem Alexander Bond that hosted the 2016 World Rowing Championships for seniors, U23 and juniors. Topic. Field hockey. In field hockey, Rotterdam has the largest hockey club in the Netherlands, HC Rotterdam, with its own stadium in the north of the city and nearly 2,400 members. The first men's and women's teams both play on the highest level in the Dutch Hoeftelasse. Topic: Baseball. Rotterdam is home to the most successful European baseball team, Neptunus Rotterdam, winning the most European Cups. Topic. Boxing Rotterdam has a long boxing tradition starting with BEP Van Clavern 1907-1992, a.k.a. the Dutch Windmill, gold medal winner of the 1928 Amsterdam Olympics, followed by professional boxers like Rogelio Tour and Don Diego Piotr. Topic. Swimming Rotterdam's swimming tradition started with Marie Braun aka Zu's sister, Braun, who was coached to a gold medal at the 1928 Amsterdam Olympics by her mother Ma Braun, and three European titles three years later in Paris. In her career as 14-time national champ, she broke six world records. Ma Braun later also coached the Rotterdam-born, three times Olympic champion Rye Mastenbroek during the Berlin Olympics in 1936. 
In later years Ing de Bruggen became a Rotterdam sport icon as triple Olympic gold medal winner in 2000 and triple European gold medal winner in 2001. Topic. Motorcycle racing Motorcycle Speedway was staged in the Feyenoord Stadium after the Second World War. The team which raced in a Dutch league was known as the Feyenoord Tigers. The team included Dutch riders and some English and Australian riders. Topic. Sportsmen of the Year election Since 1986, the city has selected its best sportsman, woman and team at the Rotterdam Sports Awards election, held in December. Topic. Other famous Rotterdam athletes Mia Adina, a retired Indonesia-born badminton player, living in Rotterdam. Nelly Kuman, a Surinamese-born retired athlete who held the 60 meters dash world record and was the world and European champion in that event. Robert Dornbos, a Rotterdam-born race car driver who competed in the Formula One. Robert Einhorn, a Rotterdam-born retired MLB shortstop who competed for the New York Yankees, the Anaheim Angels, and the New York Mets. Dex Elmont, a Rotterdam-born judoka, who finished second in the European Championships in 2009 in the 65 to 73 kilograms (143 to 161 pounds) division. Guillaume Elmont, a Rotterdam-born judoka, who became world champion in 2005 in the 73 to 81 kilograms (161 to 179 pounds) division. Francisco Elson, a Rotterdam-born basketball player who played in the NBA, won the NBA Finals in 2007 with the San Antonio Spurs. Ignatius Geisa, a Ghanaian-born long jumper with a personal best of 8.43 meters (27.66 feet), residing in Rotterdam since 2001. Geisa is a multiple medal winner in several international events, both as a citizen of Ghana and the Netherlands. Francis Honselaar, a Rotterdam-born female darts player, generally recognized as the best Dutch female darts player ever. Robert Lethuers, an athlete born in a Rotterdam suburb, specialized in the 800 meters. Lethuers gained international notoriety when he got disqualified after shoving Irish athlete David McCarthy in the 2010 European Championships. Fatima Morera de Mello, a Rotterdam-born, three times Olympic champion in field hockey. Morera de Mello currently is a professional poker player. Pete Rosenberg, a Rotterdam-born drafts player, who was the world champion from 1948 to 1956 and the eight-time Dutch champion. Betty Stowe, a Rotterdam-born retired female tennis double specialist and ten-time Grand Slam winner. Ingmar Voss, a Rotterdam-born decathlete, with a personal best of 8,224 points. Topic. Yearly events Rotterdam hosts several annual events unique to the city. It hosts the Zomkarnival, Summer Carnival, the second-largest Caribbean carnival in Europe, originally called the Antillian Carnival. Other events include, North Sea Jazz Festival, the largest jazz festival in Europe, Bavaria City Race, a Formula One race inside the city centre and a three-day-long maritime extravaganza called the World Port Days celebrating the Port of Rotterdam. January. Zesdags van Rotterdam. Six-day track cycling race, Ahoy Rotterdam. January. International Film Festival Rotterdam. February, Rotterdam Open ABM AMRO ATP 500 Tennis Tournament, Ahoy Rotterdam. April to June. Rotterdam Marathon. Koningsdag Festival, the 27th of April. July. North Sea Jazz Festival, second weekend of July. Summer Carnival. August. 
Bavaria City Race, Plain Bioscope, Dag van de Romantische Musik, Romantic Music Festival, September, The World Port Days. Topic: Transportation. Rotterdam offers connections by international, national, regional and local public transport systems, as well as by the Dutch motorway network. Motorways There are several motorways to, from Rotterdam. The following four are part of its, Ring, Ring Road. A20, Ring North, Hoek van Holland, Rotterdam, Gouda. A16, Ring East, Rotterdam, Breda, Antwerp, Paris. A15 Ring South Europort Rotterdam Nijmegen A4 Ring West Rotterdam The Hague Amsterdam The following two other motorways also serve Rotterdam A13 Amsterdam The Hague Delft Rotterdam A29 Antwerp Bergen op Zoom Rotterdam Airport much smaller than the international hub Schiphol Airport, Rotterdam The Hague Airport, formerly known as Zestienhoven, is the third largest airport in the country, behind Schiphol Airport and Eindhoven Airport. Located north of the city, it has shown a very strong growth over the past five years, mostly caused by the growth of the low-cost carrier market. For business travelers, Rotterdam The Hague Airport offers advantages in terms of rapid handling of passengers and baggage. Environmental regulations make further growth uncertain. Train Rotterdam is well connected to the Dutch railway network, and has several international connections. Southern direction Dordrecht, Breda, Eindhoven, Flushing, Vlissingen, also international trains to Belgium, France. Western direction Hoek van Holland. Northwestern direction The Hague, Leiden, Amsterdam. Northern direction high speed rail Schiphol Amsterdam Northeastern direction Utrecht and further A fifth alternative train system to the Hague the Hofplein line was converted to the light rail system Randstadrail in 2006 The city is often mentioned as the terminus of the Eurasian land bridge railway stations Rotterdam Central Rotterdam's main station Rotterdam Alexander eastern part of Rotterdam Rotterdam Block, close to the center of Rotterdam. Rotterdam Lombarden, most southern part of Rotterdam. Rotterdam Noord, northern part of Rotterdam. Rotterdam Zuid, northern part of the southern part of Rotterdam. Rotterdam Stadion, a station near the Feyenoord Stadium, open in connection with football matches and music concerts. The main connections. Direct international services to Belgium and France via high-speed train system, Thales. Frequent international trains to Antwerp and Brussels, Belgium. Frequent services within the Netherlands. Intercity line to The Hague, Leiden, Schiphol Airport and Amsterdam, North. Intercity line to Utrecht and on to Deventer or Enschied, the East, Leeuwarden, Northwest or Groningen, Northeast. Intercity line to Dordrecht, Rosendahl and on to Vlissingen, Southwest. Intercity line to Dordrecht, Breda, Tilburg, Eindhoven and Venlo, Southeast. Night services every hour connecting every day of the week to Delft, The Hague, Leiden, Schiphol Airport, Amsterdam, and, with a detour, Utrecht. On Thursday, Friday and Saturday night services either direct or via a detour, to Den Bosch, Eindhoven, Tilburg, Rosendahl. Several semi-fast services and local trains originate or call at Rotterdam Central, semi-fast services Amsterdam Breda. Detailed information available from the site of the Nederlandse Spoorwegen Dutch Railways in Rotterdam. Public transport services are provided by the following companies. NS Dutch Railways, National Train Services. RET Rotterdamse Elektrische Tram, Tram, City Bus, Metro, Randstadrail and Ferry Services in Rotterdam and surrounding cities Arriva Netherlands, Regional Bus Services Connexion, Regional Bus Services Veolia, Regional Bus Services, Metro In 1968, Rotterdam was the first Dutch city to open a metro system. Currently the metro system consists of three main lines, each of which has its own variants. 
The metro network has 78.3 kilometers, 48.7 miles of rail tracks and there are 62 stations, which makes it the biggest of the Benelux. The system is operated by five lines, three lines A, B and C on the east-west line, and two D and E on the north-south line. Line E Randstadrail connects Rotterdam with The Hague as of December 2011. Tram The Rotterdam Tramway Network offers nine regular tram lines and four special tram lines with a total length of 93.4 km Service Tram lines in Rotterdam as of 2016. 2. Rotterdam, Charleroi, Rotterdam Lombarden NS, Rotterdam Kaiserswaard runs only to the southern part of the city. 4. Rotterdam Molenlaan, Rotterdam Central, Rotterdam Marconeplein. 7. Rotterdam Oostplein, Rotterdam Central, Rotterdam Willemsplein. 8. Rotterdam Spangen, Rotterdam Central, Rotterdam Klyweg. 20 Rotterdam Central, Rotterdam Lombarden NS, Rotterdam Lombarden. 21 Schiedam Woudhoek, Station Schiedam Centrum, Rotterdam Central, Rotterdam Dash. 23 Rotterdam Marconeplein, Rotterdam Central, Rotterdam Bevervaart. 24 Vlardingen Holy, Station Schiedam Centrum, Rotterdam Central, Rotterdam Dash. 25 Rotterdam Schiebrook, Rotterdam Central Berendrecht Carnesland Special tram lines 10 Historical tram line only runs in summer and throughout the whole city for tourist information using historical Rotterdam trams from the year 1931 18 Tram line from Rotterdam Central Station towards Park runs only at the Dunya Festival and during the Rotterdam World Port Days 12. Rotterdam Central, Stadion Feyenoord or Rotterdam Central, Het Kasteel, The Castle, Sparta Stadium. Football tramline, only for big fixtures at Stadion Feyenoord or Het Kasteel. Snert Tram, historical tram, only in winter as a tourist tram through Rotterdam. Passengers are provided with a cup of Snert, Rotterdam dialect for Erwin Soap, Pea Soup. Rolling Stock is a historical Rotterdam tram from 1968. Iges Tram, summer version of the Snert Tram, providing tourists with Iges ice cream rather than Snert. Bus Rotterdam offers 55 city bus lines with a total length of 432.7 km miles. RET runs buses in the city of Rotterdam and surrounding places like Spitschkenies, Berendrecht, Ritterkirk, Roon, Portugal, Schiedam, Vlardingen, Delft and Kapel on den IJssel. Arriva Netherlands, Conexion and Veolia run buses from other cities to Rotterdam. Waterbus The Waterbus network consists of seven lines. The main line, Line 20, stretches from Rotterdam to Dordrecht. The ferry carries about 130 passengers and there is space for 60 bicycles. The stops between Rotterdam and Dordrecht are Rotterdam Erasmusbrug, Krimpen on den IJssel Stormpolder, Ritterkirk de Schans, Alblasserdam Cade, Hendrik Edo Ambacht Nordienda, Papendrecht Westein, Dordrecht Merwikade. Topic: International Relations. Rotterdam has city and port connections throughout the world. In 2008, the city had 13 sister cities, 12 partner cities, and 4 sister ports. Since 2008, the city of Rotterdam doesn't forge new sister or partner connections. Sister and partner cities are not a priority in international relations. On the 15th of March 2017, the Turkish president expressed his wish that Istanbul should no longer be the twin town of Rotterdam. A speaker of the Rotterdam municipality then explained that the two cities have no official partnership. Both authorities do cooperate often. Topic. Twin towns, sister cities Rotterdam is twinned with Topic. Partner cities
Topic: <laughs> Sister ports. Kobe since 1967. Busan since 1987. Seattle since 1969. Tokyo since 1989. Topic: Places named after Rotterdam. New Rotterdam, Nickery District, Suriname. Rotterdam, New York, United States. Rotterdam, Limpopo, South Africa. Topic: Notable residents. Topic: In popular culture. Rotterdam features in Edgar Allan Poe's short story, The Unparalleled Adventure of One Hans Fall, 1835, as well as J.T. Sheridan Le Fanu's Strange Event in the Life of Shalkin the Painter, 1839, part of Jackie Chan's 1998 film Who Am I, is set in Rotterdam. Ender's Shadow, part of the series Ender's Game is partially set in Rotterdam. In Season 1, Episode 2 of The Golden Girls. Guess who's coming to the wedding? Dorothy reminisces how her ex-husband, Stan, would buy her tulips after they had a fight. Towards the end, our house looked like Easter in Rotterdam. In 1996, the British band The Beautiful South recorded a song named after this region titled Rotterdam, or anywhere, in the 2004 video game Hitman, Contracts, The Levels, Rendezvous in Rotterdam, and Deadly Cargo. Both take place in Rotterdam. The 2017 Olivier Award winning play, Rotterdam, written by John Britton, is set in the city. In Battlefield V, this city is used as a BFV map and according to its history, the white building was almost left untouched by the bombing during World War II and that building can be seen on both in-game and real world. Topic. See also Government of Rotterdam